Okay guys, so I printed out the calibration cube in the center now and it's not completely accurate because you can see the Z is sort of alright but over here on the edge it's a little weird I don't really understand but this is the center so it's not too horrible I mean it looks nice and smooth on the left hand side it's just this right hand side that is the Y looks a little bit um, weird on the bottom over here so I'm gonna use my paint scraper tool to tap it off really quick so you guys can see it better there it goes so I still want to get me a new 3d printer just in case because I don't really understand what is happening with this one but um you can see that there is like a little I don't know what that really is exactly but it's not completely accurate so like right there it's a little like odd so I'm not exactly sure that's the middle and then we got the edge over here on the front right or the back right and that one looks way more better I don't know what it is about the right that is printing it looks better but it looks like the right prints better and then the center is a little odd so I'm not sure exactly what's happening but um, if you guys have any information you can give me so that way I can know to try to fix this but um so far that's what I'm at so I'll try printing out other things other than just the cube I got some um, spacers that I wanted to make for uh, the 3d printer that I'm trying to build so like I'm gonna be testing out all that st stuff on the ender 3 I'll probably be printing in that area that I know that seems like it does okay and so the back right I hope you guys liking the video Thank you for watching. Now, I guess you could say this is part six since I made part five of me showing you guys this cube basically coming out. And it's looking okay. Um, the top is a little strange because it's got some like weird looking issue. Like, you see those little like holes, I guess? I don't really know what that's about. And I know it's not the filament because that filament's still pretty new. And on top of that, like, I was always using this 3D printer and then it's just now that it's starting to have this issue. So I'm not sure. I'm just going to be done messing with getting a whole bunch of parts and stuff for this printer. I'll get one more thing and that's going to be a, um, a, a plate, a um, glass bed plate. So that way I can remove the uh, mirror that I have on here right now. But I hope you guys watching the video. Please like, share, subscribe. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. And if you have any uh, information you can give me, I would appreciate it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.